Reasons to hate the EU, number one. Do I hate the EU? Totally. I hate it. I hate it for what it has become. Because the promise it had was uh, almost magical. But uh, they've managed to destroy it. And I'll give you an example of why. Um, if in any democracy, majority usually passes the vote. And if you had a democracy where you had to have unanimity of opinion, well, it wouldn't work, would it? You know, let's try ours. We've got a government elected on 33% of the adult vote, and they're in. Yeah? So imagine a situation where you've got 28 people voting. 15 would give you a majority. What are the chances of getting all 28 to agree on anything. Have you ever known a situation where you've got 28 people and they all agree? So you set it up for unanimity and you've you set it up to fail. It should be 15 carries the vote or over 50%. Another thing allied to that is that how is it, how can it be that you can have a situation where you have qualified voting where some members, sovereign nations, carry a, a stronger voice than others. How can that be? How can Germany and France and England have a higher um, weight added to their vote? We got rid of qualified voting 200 years ago. And why did we get rid of it? Because it, it was a manifest tyranny, basically. It was a way of entrenching vested interest in the wealthy in power. And that's what it's doing in the EU. It is making sure that the so-called First Nations, France, Germany, Britain, Holland to some extent, Belgium, <laughs> Belgium, First Nations, please, you know? That's the doormat that we all wipe our feet on as we're invading each other historically. You know, I'm sorry, Belgium, it's a very nice place and I've been there and it's lovely, but, you know, you're not that important at all. Um, so there you go, you know. Are we going to tolerate a situation where France and Germany rip up the dream because of their own petty ambitions, their imperialistic attitudes? For example, Madame Merkel and her decision to grant um, asylum to a million people. She doesn't have that authority. She's just took it. Nobody stopped her. You know, Hungary disagree. Czech Republic disagree. Estonia disagree. Do their attitudes and, and, and opinions not count? No, they don't. Why? Because you have qualified voting. You have a situation where the great powers who are falling to bits um, impose their will on other people by, because they have a, a larger vote. That is not democracy. That is tyranny. And that is one reason to hate the EU. Filthy tyranny. That's my view. And I'm not going to change it. More reasons to hate the EU, EU will be coming up. But that's a good one. Um, their anti-democratic attitude. Their tyranny.